welcome back to this new session so in the last class we have started the miscellaneous exercise 1 and uh, in which we completed the first section which belongs to the mcq part and we started the second section and we solved the first question from that which is nothing but the this one okay the central angle of the oh no ye nahi hai which oh yes find the number of sides of a regular polygon if each of its interior angle is 3 pi by 4 this was the first question from the section number 2 and we saw this so this question talks about the exterior angle find the how many sides are there for a given polygon if the interior angle is 3 pi by 4 and we have used very well known theorem that is what the interior plus exterior it is always equals to 180 degree interior plus exterior is always equals to 180 degree this theorem we have used and we have calculated and our formula reduces to n theta e equals to 2 pi where n is what is the number of sides for a given polygon n is the number of sides for a given polygon theta e is the exterior angle it is equals to 2 pi okay remember this for a given polygon regular polygon okay so if it is irregular then no one can find out it so you need to have so many uh, constructions for that okay so without any further delay let's start the second question so let me take the second question So any doubt till this point, you can ask me directly, no problem. Okay. So this is what we have the second question. It says that huh. the question is visible, I hope. Is it? Yes. Okay. Two circles, each of radius 7 cm, intersects each other. The distance between their centers is 7 root 2 cm. Find the area of the portion common to both the circles. Okay. There are two circles and both the circles are having the radius of 7 cm. Okay. Means what we can say is both are the identical circles. Okay. Suppose this is what we have circle number 1 and suppose we have this as the circle number 2 and assume both are the same okay size madhe doni same as okay so let's draw the centers for this what is this length yes what is this length radius this is nothing but the radius exactly very good so let's consider this as uh, o1 that is a uh, center of the first circle this is the center of the second circle o2 this is 7 centimeter and this is also 7 centimeter because the radius of the same circle again we have these oh, sorry again we have these two lines what about this how much this length is How much this length is? Yes, anyone? 7 cm. It is 7 cm still because what they have said is both the circles have 7 cm. Okay, so this is 7 and this is also 7. And one more information they have given that the distance between their centers is 7 root 2 cm. Which distance? O1, O2 distance they have given. So O1, O2 distance is nothing but 7 root 2. Okay. So let me write this is 7 root 2 centimeter. Is it okay? Now find the area of the portion common to both circles. Now which is the which is the area which is common to both circle? This part is the common to both circle and we want to find out the area of this part. Now, how you will find out the area of this part? Yes, anyone please, can you suggest me any good approach? How you will find out the area of this 
segment so let's name this as a point this point and let's take this as a b point yes how we can do yes please anyone no idea see here ha ah, yes sir je aapne shaded portion ana titun ek perpendicular takaycha tar doni doni sector che area kadaycha ani perpendicular jitun takle ana mate don triangle form hotel mate don triangle cha pan area kadaycha good mag nantar very good very good mag nantar kay karnar barobar तसे सेक्टर मधून दोन्ही सेक्टर मधून ते जे काही दोन्ही एरिया ते माइनस करायचे आपल्याला ते एक्सेलेंट हाफ ऑफ गावतील मध्ये त्यांचा फक्त प्लस करायचं करेक्ट वेरी यस यस वेरी बट इंस्टेड ऑफ टेकिंग ट्रायंगल व्हाट इफ इफ आई टेक द एरिया ऑफ द स्क्वायर लेट्स सी हियर द एरिया ऑफ शेडेड रीजन एरिया ऑफ शेडेड रीजन एरिया ऑफ शेडेड पार्ट इज इक्वल टू See here, the area of sector A O one B, area of sector A O one B. Okay, area of sector A O one B. मतलब ये sector हो गया. So let me draw this sector. This sector plus area of sector a o to b matlab which sector now this set this sector okay but i want this shaded region so what if if i subtract minus area of square exactly minus area of square if i do area of square a o 1 b o 2 then can i get the area of the shaded region yes everyone yes okay so area of sector a1 first sector plus area of sec second sector minus the area of the this square then i will exactly get the area of the shaded region so let's find out i hope you have understood this step this step is very important very important okay what is the area of sector for first circle sorry first sector which is r into theta see if this is square if this is a square what could be this angle what what could be this angles 90 90 degrees okay so this is 90 degree and this is also 90 degree so theta 90 degree okay dono case mein and what we have is the r as a 7 so what is the area of sector area of sector is always given by 1 by 2 r स्क्वायर थीटा इट्स आर स्क्वायर थीटा सो यहाँ पे आएगा आर स्क्वायर थीटा वन प्लस वन बाय टू आर स्क्वायर थीटा टू माइनस व्हाट इज द एरिया ऑफ स्क्वायर विच इज नथिंग बट साइड स्क्वायर एरिया ऑफ एरिया ऑफ द स्क्वायर क्या रहता है इट इज नथिंग बट द साइड का स्क्वायर ओके यस सो लाव लेट सब्सिट्यूट द वैल्यू इज वन बाय टू आर स्क्वायर मतलब कितना है सेवन सेवन स्क्वायर इज फोर्टी नाइन Plus theta is how much? It's a pi by two. It's it should be in the radian. Please remember. Plus one by two, forty nine pi by two minus forty nine. Is it okay, everyone? Yes. Okay, see here. One by two, forty nine pi by two plus one by two. मंजे आर्धा half forty nine pi by two, half forty nine pi by two हो गया full forty nine pi by two. If I add this two, I will be getting forty nine into pi by two minus forty nine. Is it okay? So forty nine, if I take common, I will be having pi by two minus one, which is equals to forty nine into pi minus two by two. Okay. 
so this is what you get the answer centimeter square is it okay everyone so area final answer is what this is my final answer you can take any one as your final answer 41 into pi by 2 minus 1 or you can do the cross multiplication 49 pi minus 2 by 2 is it okay anyone if you have doubt please ask don't hesitate no problem बात करो यार कुछ तो बोलो यस नो नहीं नो ठीक है व्हाट अबाउट अदर्स केत की शलाका नो सो अमिषा राजेश्री निकिता जे निकिता एस चिन्मय अभिषेक रोहित हम किधर के सब लोग are you sleeping? Hmm? Nice sir. Nice. Okay. Now let's take the third question now. Okay. Yes. क्या बोल रहा है third question कि a triangle PQR is equilateral triangle with side. Okay. Let's take this. So let's highlight the given information. <clears throat> a triangle PQR is an equilateral triangle with a side 18 centimeter. Okay, equilateral triangle means sub, sub sides are 18 centimeter. A circle is drawn on a segment QR as a diameter. Okay, no problem. Find the length of the arc of this circle within the triangle. Okay, great. Look away. First, अभी रीड करने के बाद तो समझ में नहीं आ रहा है कि भाई पिक्चर कैसा रहेगा सो लेट्स ड्रॉ द फिगर एंड द क्वेश्चन बिकम्स वेरी सिंपल सी हियर वी यू हैव वन सर्कल ओके फर्स्ट वी विल टेक वन ट्रायंगल यू हैव वन ट्रायंगल पी क्यू आर दिस ट्रायंगल पी क्यू आर यू हैव and this is of course the equilateral triangle means what all the sides are of 18 centimeters so let's say this is p this is q and this is r and all the sides are of 18 centimeter 18 18 and 18 then a circle is drawn on a segment qr as a diameter so taking this qr as a diameter we have to draw a circle so let's take and draw the circle okay थोड़ा सा गलत हो गया सो लेट मी टेक द शेप सो दैट लेट सी इज इट ओके यस परफेक्ट ओके नाउ टेकिंग दिस क्यू आर एज अ डायमीटर आई हैव ड्रॉन अ सर्कल अभी क्या पूछ रहा है फाइंड द लेंथ ऑफ आर्क ऑफ दिस सर्कल विद इन द ट्रैंगल अभी ये ट्रैंगल में जो भी आर्क है दैट आर्क लेंथ आई वॉन्ट टू फाइंड आउट सो विच आर्क दे आर टॉकिंग अबाउट दिस मच आर्क दे आर टॉकिंग अबाउट दिस आर्क दे आर टॉकिंग अबाउट इज इट ओके एवरी वन इसका लेंथ निकालना है now how you will find out the length of this uh, arc yes anyone so this is the center let's name this as O as this is a 18 centimeter so this part becomes 7 and this part becomes 7 as O is at midpoint because it's a diameter this is 60 degree this is 60 degree and this part becomes 60 degree because it's an equilateral triangle Sir, 9 on Arna. Oh, sorry. 
thank you so it should be 9 and 9 thanks okay now if i draw construct the lines like this ye sector ka length nikalna hai mujhe i want to find out the sector's length okay let's name these points as a, a and b now can you tell me what will be the length of this segment oa length of this segment oa is how much what is the length of nine. segment yes it's a 9 because see here oq and oa ob and or are the radius of the same circle so if it is 9 this will also become 9 this will also become 9 okay now see here ye 60 degree hai and this will also become 60 degree because this is a isoscalar triangle sorry sorry this will become 60 degree okay okay see here because of this 9 and 9 these two angles become 60 degree so here also we have this as a 60 degree but if this is 60 this is 60 obviously the third angle will also be 60 degree third angle will also be 60 degree is it okay everyone oh now tell me what will be this angle what will be that angle see this total angle is 180 Sir, this two. Card hai, na? Yes, we have to arc length. Card hai, so, AB arc length is equal to what? What is the formula? It is R into theta. You know the R, you know the radius, but you don't know the theta. So, that theta is nothing but this. So, how much this is total is 180 degree. So, in that 180 degree, ye 60 hai or ye 60 hai. So, ye kitna ho sakta hai? 60. 60 rega. So, this part becomes 60 degree. Now you have everything, everything. You have R and you have theta. Okay, so this is equals to R is nothing but 9 and theta is nothing but 60. Pi by 3. Okay, so it becomes pi by 3. Okay, this is equal to 3. So answer is equal to 3. It's a 3 pi. See, getting the answer is just a matter of two lines. But constructing is very very important it's a very 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 important you should understand these approaches how we can proceed for a given question okay so once you are okay with these approaches you are done you can solve any type of questions which are based on these concepts so please make sure that you are understanding these concepts do not leave any doubts in your mind okay so with this let's start the next question find the radius of the circle in which the central angle is 60 degree intercept and arc length of 37.4 centimeter you can do this okay yahan pe kya diya hai unhone theta diya hai sorry Equilateral triangle in a puzzle. Kute fourth question. question madhe. Madhe. Triangle put a sanket to my life. Triangle hey. in is me. Find the radius Triangle. of the circle in which the central angle is 60 degree intercept an arc. Okay. You have one circle. Okay. Center. And you have the 60 degree intercept. Suppose this is what we have the 60 degree intercept. This is 60 degree. Okay. Now you have to find out Okay and this arc length also they have given So this arc length they have given this arc length is nothing but 37.4 centimeter this arc length they have given you have to find out the radius It's very very simple question Okay take this fourth question as a homework question now let's proceed to the next question question number five 
a wire of length 10 cm is a bent so as to form an arc of circle radius 4 cm what is the angle subtended ye bhi aap homework ko le lo bhai this is also same question as out of your fourth question nothing just they have given the some r theta they have given the r they are asking for the theta you should understand which information belongs to what category which is r which is theta and whether they have given r theta or they are asking for the area of sector see in the whole topic we have only two formulas one is r theta and other is 1 by 2 r square theta that's it fakta dhe don formula hai next question if two arcs of the same length in two circles subtends angle of 65 degree and 110 degree at the center find the ratio of their radius this also you can do as a homework because this type of question we have already solved in which what they have given is the ratio of the angles they have given okay so the ratio of the angles they have given so you have to find out the ratio of their radius who will tell me how you will do yes how you will do this type of question we have already seen so let's take i will give you the hint you complete as a homework question okay if two arcs of the same length same length hai matlab what is r into theta is same arc length is same for the two arcs in two circles subtends angle of 65 degree and 110 degree at the center find the ratio of their radius this is theta 1 this is theta 2 theta 1 is equals to 65 degree theta 2 is equals to 110 degree okay so r1 by r2 kiti hai te vicharle aplyala so what is the r1 by r2 they have mentioned that r into theta is same okay so let's take this r1 theta 1 it is equals to r2 theta 2 because they have the same arc length so this is what the given information is so from this can i take r2 on this side so r1 by r2 it is equals to theta 2 by theta 1 any problem any one any problem for in this nahi it is equals to theta 2 ka value kitna hai bhai 110 degree theta 1 ka value kitna hai ye 65 degree देखो भाई क्या कैंसिल होगा ये गया भाई पांच दूनी दहा पांच दूनी दहा पांच एक पांच पांच तिरपन्द सो इट इज नथिंग बट ट्वेंटी टू बाई थर्टीन दिस इज वॉट यू गेट द आंसर ट्वेंटी टू बाई थर्टीन सो आर वन बाय आर टू इज इट ओके सो यू शुड यू शुड राइट द आंसर इन दिस डायरेक्शन ओनली फर्स्ट कुटला दिला एंड सेकेंड कुटला दिला सो दे हैव गिवन दी फर्स्ट इज द सिक्सटी फाइव डिग्री एंड द सेकेंड वन इज वन वन जीरो डिग्री सो यू हैव टू टेक इन दैट डायरेक्शन ओनली सो सिक्सटी फाइव बाय वन वन जीरो शुड बी योर आंसर विच इज नथिंग बट थर्टीन बाय ट्वेंटी टू बिकॉज वी हैव डिस्कस्ड दिस कंसेप्ट इन वन ऑफ माई प्रीवियस वीडियो आई होप यू रिमेंबर इज इट यू हैव टू राइट यूर आंसर इन दिस डायरेक्शन ओनली of course you will find this as your first option a this will be option your b if you tick mark this option it is absolutely wrong because they want the answer should be in this direction only in this direction matlab kya hai pehla ya circle se aala pahe nantar ya circle se aala pahe see is it okay yes perfect okay now let's see the next question the area of the circle is 18 pi square centimeter okay area of the circle dela hai okay let's take this question it's simple one <coughs> area of the circle is 18 pi 
एटी वन पाई स्क्वेर सेंटीमीटर फाइंड द लेंथ ऑफ आर्क सेप्टेंडिंग एन एंगल ऑफ थ्री हंड्रेड डिग्री एट द सेंटर एंड ऑल्सो एरिया ऑफ द करस्पॉन्डिंग सेक्टर ओके कोई बात चलो लेट्स ड्रॉ द फिगर दिस इज द सर्कल वी हैव लेट्स से दिस इज द सेंटर ओके एंड वी हैव द एरिया ऑफ दिस सर्कल इज नथिंग बट हाउ मच इट्स अ पाई आर स्क्वायर इट इज नथिंग बट एटी वन पाई ओके फाइंड द लेंथ ऑफ द आर्क सप्टेंडिंग एन एंगल ऑफ थ्री हंड्रेड डिग्री सो सपोज दिस इज द फर्स्ट सेगमेंट ओ ए थ्री हंड्रेड डिग्री सप्टेंड कर रहा है मतलब समवेयर हियर यू विल गेट द सेकेंड सेगमेंट सो दिस एंगल दे हैव गिवन एज अ थ्री हंड्रेड डिग्री आई होप यू आर गेटिंग दिस नाउ वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट द लेंथ ऑफ दिस आर्क द लेंथ ऑफ दिस आर्क वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट ये आर्क का मुझे लेंथ निकालना है इज इट ओके एवरी वन एंड ऑल्सो द एरिया ऑफ द करस्पॉन्डिंग सेक्टर सो एरिया ऑफ दिस सेक्टर ऑल्सो वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट ये जो बड़ा सेक्टर है ना इसका एरिया भी मुझे निकालना है वॉट इज द बेस्ट वे what is the best way in which you can solve this question you have two methods for this question first is direct approach you take theta as a 300 degree and proceed or you can take theta as a 60 degree do the calculations and subtract from the whole circle is it okay so they have given the pi r square is equals to 81 pi so this pi pi gets cancelled so r square is equals to 81 so r aa gaya mera mind सो so, सर्कल का रेडियस आ गया नाइन सेंटीमीटर सो आर इज इक्वल्स टू नाइन एंड थीटा इज इक्वल्स टू थ्री हंड्रेड डिग्री ओके फाइंड आउट दी आर्क लेंथ सो आर्क लेंथ इज इक्वल्स टू आर्क लेंथ इज इक्वल्स टू आर इंटू थीटा विच इज नथिंग बट नाइन इंटू थ्री हंड्रेड इंटू पाई बाय वन एटी ये गया भाई ओके सो ये दिस विल गो बाय फिफ्टीन एंड दिस विल गो बाय नाइन तीन पाँच पंद्रह तीन त्रिक नौ सो दिस विल बी एंड दिस थ्री एंड कैंसल्स दिस बाय थ्री सो आई विल बी हैविंग थ्री इंटू फाइव इज फिफ्टीन पाय ओके सो आर थीटा इज नथिंग बट हाउ मच इट्स अ फिफ्टीन पाय इज इट ओके एवरी The answer is fifteen oh, yes. pi. That is arc length is fifteen pi. Now how we will find out the area then? So area of the so here only I will do the area of the sector which is nothing but one by two r square theta which is nothing but one by two r square is nothing but eighty one into theta is how much? It's nothing but five pi by three. Five pi by three. So this cancels by three twenty six three seventy one twenty. Okay. So this is nothing but. ये आ गया देखो भाई सत्ता पचास पच्चीस क्या रही तीन आ गया पांच दुनिया दा सो one thirty five by two ये आ गया मेरा pi. So this is nothing but the sector का area. Is it okay everyone? See in this way we can proceed for any type of questions. Oh sorry. Uh, let me have a box for this. Okay. Good. So these are the two. Sir, values. Yes, sorry. Sir, sorry. Value upon that card, Lila. Na, sir, directly uh, one by two into nine into fifteen pi ke la. Sir, same mala sir answer. Kaise chhe value? आर थी हाँ, हाँ, हो आर थी मगर इंटू आर जारी इंटू नाइन जारी डिवाइड बाय टू के सर यस नोर्स इधे जर तुम्हें मल्टीप्लाय बाय नाइन इंटू फिफ्टीन पाय बाय टू के आंसर पंद्रह नवे पस्तीस अशे फिफ्टीन इंटू नाइन वन थर्टी फाइव से Now the second approach you can think of 
is that get the total area which they have given as a 81 pi from this total area if you subtract this area then you will get this green wala area is it okay so while doing the homework please think of this approach and use all with the help of this that is area of sector aob small aob okay area of sector aob minus sorry area of circle area of circle minus area of sector aob is nothing but the desired area is it okay so you try this approach and verify that you are getting the same answer you should get same answer for this also you can do the same arc length ke liye so total arc length for a given circle is always 2 pi r ha 2 pi r madun suppose if i subtract this much arc which is ab then also you should get the same answer which is nothing but 15 pi okay you take this approach as a homework and let's verify you are getting the same answers is it okay so what is time now so it's yes it's 7:56 so we can stop here and we will meet tomorrow with the same question and the remaining questions so the remaining questions you can think of uh okay no problem we will solve all those remaining questions you can think of the question number 11 which is of the arithmetic progression so you can think of the question number 11 take the today's all class all questions as a homework and uh, try solving in a fair notebook tomorrow in the next class we will retouch the question number 8 9 and 10 and in the remaining portion we will start our next topic that is a trigonometry very very important topic so please do not miss any class of this trigonometry which will be very helpful for you for your next classes okay so with this we will stop here thank you